Hello everybody, my name is Japan the King, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Union Cross, or Unchained Key. I don't remember. In this episode, we are going to be tackling the new special event quest, A New Friend, if it will load. There we go. We're gonna use my, uh, my stupid overpowered keyblade to absolutely wreck face. So that's where one of the Dalmatians was. This motherfucker, they silent. Maybe she's new. But no time for that. Today's mission is a doozy. You need to focus. Got it? No, not in the slightest. Run away from the talking cat. Just realized that I don't have the volume on for this. There we go, that's better. Ever so professional. And absolutely destroy the tiny pathetic heartless. Make sure that I find everyone before I go on. Okay. I feel like I skipped someone. Did I? No, I'm just being stupid. That's not anything new. Swunk. So yeah, like I said in the last video, this, uh... I probably should have made sure to clear some space on my, my phone. Oh well. The different Heartless have different strengths and weaknesses. Like, some of them are weak against strength of metals, some against speed metals, some against magic. What you got about... got against magic, huh? You know what? Nova! Science now. Yee -hee. Completely wrecked the challenges. A skip ticket. I never used one. This time a blue bit. He's just uh, just a bit stronger. Double check that there ain't nothing down here. Cause you know, these games like to be sneaky and hide stuff behind. Hmm. What time we at? Okay. We Gucci, we Gucci man. Obliteration! So, in case you guys haven't been able to tell, these games, the Kingdom Hearts games, have are heavily based on Disney films. All the places you go to are, almost all of them, are Disney movies. 
What's your guys' favorite Disney movie? I don't remember if I asked that in the last video. Professional, I know. I keep forgetting to check things before the video. Oh, didn't notice that one. Probably, probably shouldn't have used the metal that does 50 fucking hits. Um. Uh. Yeah. Oh, well. Let's, let's just keep going. No, nothing to see there. Totally didn't just completely fuck it up. <laughs> We, we got this. We don't need to be any sort of good. <clears throat> Excuse me, I burped. Oh. Game lagged for a second there. Now this time, one of the goals is not do 10 hits or less. It's just get a shit ton of luck. And to do that, you gotta kill everything in one turn. Make him know you're the ball. I think it's kind of cool the amount of Heartless, though, that have been made specifically for this game. Like, you don't see them in any other Kingdom Hearts game. At least, m most of them that I know of. I still haven't played all the way through, uh... Not Birth by Sleep, uh... The one with Roxas. 358 over two days, that's it. I haven't played through that one all the way yet. So there might be some Heartless in there that I know literally nothing about. One of these nights I really gotta get back into the swing of playing that. It's fun. It's different from Kingdom Hearts, but it's... It's fun. <laughs> do 50,000 with one hit. Hmm. I, I wonder how I could do that. Maybe with the fucking power of gods in my hand. You, you think that's a possibility? Yep. Considering that was almost five million and I just needed five fucking thousand. God, I love using attacks that are way, way too strong for the enemy. Like in Dark Souls, if you have a fully upgraded Black Knight Great Sword, and you go up to a fucking pygmy and just swing, and the tip just barely scrapes his kneecap, dead. Most horrifying, brutal death he has ever experienced. And, you know, when you kind of think about Dark Souls, you know, people get sad when they have to either have to or choose to kill the NPCs, right? Well, you're you're in a land where death means nothing. Them dying just means they'll respawn at the bonfire. Just means they don't want to talk to you no more. Cuz they know that guy's a dick. He shoved a great... He say... He shoved a Black Knight halberd up my ass. I was tasting charred metal and shit for a week. Well... Hey! 
So, the raid bosses. There are... As you progress through the story, you earn different raid bosses that can be spawned. And some of them only spawn during certain stages. Like the... The Dark Side Heartless, he... He mainly spawns on the really, really early stages. And then his upgraded version appears on the later stages. Just like with the Trick Master and... I think there was one more low-level... Behemoth! Behemoth, that's what it was. Tactical Nuke! Stun for... Oh, no, he, he's not stunned. He's, he's very much dead. So, for the longest time, like, when I was a kid, what I thought happened when you killed a Heartless is, like, the Heartless or Nobody or whatever it was that you just killed would get sucked into the Keyblade and it would, like, live there as a prison. And it just dropped all of its stuff because, well, it's in prison now. You confiscate a whole of it. I'm thinking it's either that, or it's the light rewarding you. Fuck it, let's use, let's use Richard's. Richard's metal. Ain't gonna be touched, but he's gonna get it used. Ooh, that's, that's another one of the cool things about this game. If, if you have a really strong metal that you think your team could use, like, it would be useful for them because it's so strong or it has an ability attached to it, whatever. You can share it with your teammates. I personally have always liked the, I think they're referred to as reverse metals in this, but I just call them dark metals because, well, the characters in them are darkness based, so. Oh. I should have been using my special attack more. Well, fuck. Um. That's awkward. That's very sexually awkward. Don't know why sexually, but it's awkward. I choose for it to be sexually awkward. I should shut up now. Well, I guess that's gonna do it for this video, guys. Sorry it's not longer, but... Well, that's just kind of what happens when you're an idiot and don't ch decide to check how much time space you have. Well, I might, I might do another video soon, like sooner than the schedule normally says to, just because this one was so short. But then after that, the schedule will be back on track with Skylanders... Uh, the Plug and Play, Kingdom Hearts, Skylanders, Plug and Play, etc., etc. And, yeah. Well, hope you guys enjoyed this one. And next time, when we come back to Kingdom Hearts, Unchained Key, or Union Cross, I forget what the current one is. We are going to continue the A New Friend mission set. Alright, hope you guys are looking forward to it. I know I am. See you guys. Bye.